Hey there view, welcome to step number five of the create reports and dashboards for sales and marketing managers projects. In this step, we are going to go through summary formulas in reports, summarize your data in a whole new way. Summary formulas are a great way to calculate additional totals based on the numerical values in your reports. In addition to the standard summaries that we used in previous step, you can add up to 5 summary formulas to summary and matrix reports to create calculated summaries of your numerical fields. Your VP of sales knows what each of her reps have in their pipelines. However, she would also like to see how they are closing deals. Let's build a report to show her percentage of closed opportunities are actually being won. Modify the opportunities by rep report to display closed opportunities by sales rep. Okay, let me open the trailground, uh, the trailhead playground real quick. And we are supposed to go to the reports tab. Arrow next to opportunities bar. Okay. Added filter pane opportunity status. Closed, click apply. I think maybe we, are, we should go into split screen view, just a second. And there we go. Add a custom summary formula to display the win rate by sales rep. Click the outline pane. Click the arrow next to columns. Add summary formula, column name or win rate, description. Description is there, I was already wondering. This doesn't look like a description field. And so the percent is to. Place the cursor in the formula section and complete the details. In the search field type, one ensure some and click in the root. Place the cursor in the field after sum and enter backslash. In the search fields menu, type and select closed and then insert. Sure, your formula looks like this. Yes, it does. So, one sum divided by closed sum. And we're supposed to click apply. Let's validate this. It's valid. 
At the bottom of the preview pane, slide the logo next to details, row to add details. Save the report as a new report called Sales Rep Win Rate in the Global Sales Report folder. Uh, let's verify this and let's have a look what this looks like here with some entries in there. One sum divided by closed sum. Thank you so much for watching this video and let's tackle the next step.